that. Can we let Cruz go? You have the ability to do it under the cap. Yep. Brandon Marshall's got plenty of football left. He's exactly what you need on the other side of the field uh, from Odell Beckham. And I think if I'm the Giants, I'm waiting for that to happen. If I'm Brandon Marshall, I sign with the Giants in a minute. I would, too. Uh, Brandon Marshall, who wants to play in the playoffs, win a Super Bowl game, or win a Super Bowl, play in a Super Bowl, whatever it may be. The Giants are they, they're, they're a player or two away from being a legitimate Super Bowl contender. I mean, they get an offensive lineman, they get another running back in the mix, and one more receiver, and I'd go, wow, the Giants are one of the best teams in football. I'll tell you, if the Giants got Adrian Peterson, Brandon Marshall, and fixed the Eric Flowers problem, they're right there. Yeah, I agree. And, that, by the, and that's all on the table. I'm not saying, hey, if I won the lottery, I'd buy a house. That's legitimately on the table to happen. They need more than a Adrian. You know, they got the Paul Perkins. That's great. I don't think Paul Perkins is your guy you want to be 25, 30 times a game. I think you want him to be your number two. Uh, I would. I won't, I don't want Adrian Peterson to be my number one either. That's, I'll say that, Craig. I mean, yeah, he's uh, he's still probably got some, some tread on the tires. I get that. But it's going into year 10 in the NFL at running back. He's been injured a lot through the years. If the price is right, sure, bring him into town. No doubt about it. And as the Giants, you might be able to get him into town for a little lower than other teams because of New York and Adrian Peterson might want to experience the New York media and see what it's like to, to play for under the big lights.